All right, peeps, today we're going to be getting into power. That is right. We need a, a mole power, baby. So we are going to be uh, upgrading this emerald generator to a power generator. Uh, I just went mining for some uh, uranite down in some caves. Got some good stuff going. Uh, oh, we got some quests here. Oh. Enderman got a bounty board, very nice. But uh, anywho, let's go ahead and start to getting into power. Sorry, power. Um, there is a booklet if you guys are following along and wanna know how to do things, but we don't need that. We're getting right into the reactor. We're gonna need a lot of redstone, a lot of this di dielectric paste. So I'm gonna go grab uh, some blaze. Shabang, bang, boom, boop, 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 boop. Creeper fell. All right, and we got ourselves a decent amount of charcoal. And we can put all these in there. Last episode, we set up this refined storage system, and it's worse in every way from AE2. Um, but we're making do. So let's go ahead and get some of this these uh, dielectric pastes created. We don't need a lot. We'll do three stacks. That feels sufficient. Okay. So let's first work on this guy. We need some redstone blocks. That's all the redstone. Well, we got more redstone. But hey, we don't have a lot of redstone, so we gotta be careful. Full stack. Very careful. Now I wanna see, can you turn these back into the big guys? You cannot. So if you turn them into the small ones, you can't go back. So let's start up. We need one, two, three, four. And we also need some of these. We're gonna take half of these, turn them into those. Um, our iron farm has been running for a while off camera. As you can see, we have a lot of iron. So we don't have to worry about that, which is great. So let's get that plugged right into here. Beautiful. Okay. Let's make some of these. Guys, here we're going to need... Got to put those in there. We're going to need, I believe, nine. Nine of those. So then we need quite a few of those. I think we need... We need 36. Yeah, we're going to try that number. Oh, we need to process up the uranite. I totally forgot about it. Okay. So you the ur The ur Come on. Don't be dumb. There we go. So the uranite, you can make a raw block of uranite, but... Wait. Can you... No, don't do that. Yeah, don't turn it into a block. Holy cow. That's a terrible idea. So you can smelt... You can blast it, but... If essentially what we want is the energizing. So it takes 2000 FE, gives us two of these. We don't really have enough for this right now, which is in fact a bummer. So we're gonna do a stack of these guys in here. This has got a speed upgrade. So these should be processed up pretty quick, but we'll help them along with this guy. Wait, no, not this guy. I'm gonna take half of these, put the other half in there. Good. I've got bad news. It's given us urinite dust. Um. Yeah, it's essentially made this worthless. Does a f normal furnace do that? Because we just wasted. All right, so we are definitely not doing it the furnace way. Get those out of here. We're going to be doubling our efforts. So we are going to be energizing them. Okay, so the good thing is we don't need any of those stupid things. We get two of these. We're going to get some of their cables. And we're gonna have a good time. So we're gonna set this up right outside behind where there's a will, there's a way. And I have a way to do this. All right, we're gonna take a bath. Get, oh, oh come on, come on. Okay, so that's, that's not my idea. We are gonna do, well, you know, maybe we go down another block, come down here, give us, give us some room. All right, go here, come up one. Oh, okay. Can you go through these? You can, that's why. That would be why I fell through. So here, you go here, and hey, wait a second, all of our items, perfect. Look, there's no more gaping hole down here, isn't that great? Ah, oh, so good, okay. Was never there. So now these guys are filled up with power. This guy is working on them. Yeah, so we'll do this. This is gonna use up a lot of power, but that's okay. Now I'll do this for a bit. All right, I think we have enough to create our first 
reactor. Uh, we do have to craft a couple more of the the guys. Yeah, okay. It's not going to be all of them. That's okay. I knew that going in. I think we need to make two more. Okay, so that should be enough now. Perfect. We got 36. Okay, we're going to get a water bucket. Don't forget the water bucket. I normally do, and you guys light me up in the chat. It's okay. You don't have to worry about it this time. I remembered. We're also going to grab some charcoal. Uh, do we have any ice yet? Oh, boy. Um, hmm. Oh, did my screen just flash? Pick. There we go. We can get some uh, some ice with this dude. There's a bunch of ice by our base. I'll go run over there real quick. We'll grab some. Okay, so let's set up. Well, we can put the reactor over here. It's not going to do us any harm to do that. Or will it? It might. Oh, no, it's gone wrong. I'm just kidding. It's good. Gotcha. <laughs> Piece of wood. Ah. All right, start a reactor. Give it some water before everything else. We'll give it some charcoal. Let's need to grab some redstone for it. Boom. And then I'm going to go get the blue ice. But we're going to repair this guy real quick. All right. So let's see here. Checking on the map. Yeah, blue ice just over here to our right. I'm actually, I'm actually looking at it. All right. So here we got a bunch of packed ice, uh, which will be fine for now. But we'll get a couple, a couple stacks of these guys. We'll just mine this whole thing down, and we'll be sitting pretty. Okay. All right, I think we got enough. Huh. All right, so we'll give it some packed ice here. Negative eight coolant, which is great. And we do actually need to generate a little bit more of the uranite. Um, once we get some decent power coming in, we can actually automate this process. Uh, by just, you know, having a hopper on one side and then an item pipe on the other side, pulling out a specific item. It's really simple. All right, I'm doing this until I get a stack. And hopefully, yeah, we got enough power. Good. Our power is going to hold out just fine. There we go. There's a stack of uranite. We put it on auto mode so it shuts off. And now we're generating about 200 FE per tick, but it's going to generate a lot longer than that guy. And we should actually be able... Let's see. One, two. We'd have to do this block. But now this is cooked in to our reactor, which is good. So we can get an item pipe. This guy here, looking at pipes. Okay. Uses. We craft this guy. Uses again. Got ourselves this guy. We're going to get a drawer. Like so. Two drawers. Okay. So place one right here. And, well, uh, hmm. We'll just move it to over here. Yeah, let's make some more of that pipe. That, uh, that power cable. Should've just made this stuff. Okay, we're gonna upgrade. Upgrade to the tier two. Okay, good. So we'll break all of that. We're gonna use the bigger cable. Actually, we'll take from this one. No, no, we won't actually. We'll place this back. Okay. So now this is hooked up, and we're going to break this block here. Oh, we just use two item pipes here. We can pull out, come this way. Wait, am I standing on it? You know, I'd be standing on it. I didn't think that was possible. Okay, so pulling items out, put this in, put that in. We're rocking. Okay, but now we do one of these. We go, no, no, we pull out here. Put our raw uranite in. Oh, <laughs> that didn't work. We need a timer. Okay, so I think we're just gonna actually have to use a standard hopper going in, like so. And we're gonna have to make a timer <clears throat> from RF Tools Utility we're out of redstone. That's okay, we got some blocks. Okay, so. This should be extremely easy to set up. We're just gonna put a dirt block here. We're gonna put a redstone torch here to lock said hopper. What? Okay, to lock said hopper. That that threw me for a loop for a second. And then we put that here. Every so often that's gonna unlock the hopper, hopefully. Do I need to give it a redstone signal? Okay, do I need a pulse extender? 
right, let's try this. Oh, wow. Okay, so here we go with the timer. Okay, that's gonna work perfect, but we just gotta get the timing down. So let's try 300 ticks. So, okay, so let's see. Hmm, need to pull these out. Oh shoot, it's never gonna work because these guys aren't set up. Well, let's upgrade these real quick. Okay, we just need two blocks of quartz. Uses, need two of these. We're out, good. Ah, wrong thing. Okay, so there's this guy, there's this guy. So now these have been upgraded. Oh, I see. Okay, so we gotta, gotta limit that from going back in. Good. Okay, so how quick is this? So if we were to do four seconds, 20 seconds to take. So if we did 80, oh, that's perfect. This is just set the two ticks. It turns it off for just a split second. So this should work. Yep, there we go. Boom, it's ready. There we go. Boom, it's ready. Good, okay. So I'm gonna take a stack out because it's only gonna allow a stack in at a time. But now we are cooking. We have automated uranite once we get it. Perfect. Looking good. Feeling good. Cool. Let's see about going to the second tier now. Whoops, this guy. So we're going to need <clears throat> th uh, nine uranite and then a bunch of these guys, which is the combination of those guys. So we're going to need four times nine is 36. So we need a total of 36 of these these guys we got it perfect we can upgrade it so we're gonna grab these guys we're gonna grab oh where's my bucket you can take the water out of this dude and you can grab it now we're gonna do this we're gonna do that put those in there put those in there 36 perfect so now we take that put it back there we go you get that get that get that get that and then we're gonna grab some uranite throw it in auto mode on and now we are generating just under a thousand fe per tick which is great so now what we want to do is we're gonna make an exporter for our system wait how do we do that yes hit control to do that it auto crafts it for us now we have an exporter so all we got to do is do one of these we're gonna grab a cable which we have right here put that here and uh, now we take one of each and we go one, two, three, and a four. And now it will fill those in automatically if we have them in our system. And then the last thing I wanna go ahead and make is an importer. This guy here, control, start. And now we can make both. Let's grab, grab a couple cables and we're going to do boom. I think the closest connection is, what are you, cobblestone? I have to break it, nope. There we go. It's a weird importer, but hey, it's an importer. So we're getting some items pumped in here. And the final thing is to connect it like so. So now that's getting power from here. And we don't need to worry about the generator in there anymore. Our system is now on the power system. And we can actually just set this guy up. Kind of maybe over here. And this will just, you know, pump, pump stuff into us. I can turn on a lever to activate it. So let's do that. There we go. Flip this lever on. Charges us. We flip it off. It stops charging us. Good. Okay. I like it like to see it i don't know if that's powering it but we're we've got it set up anyway well cool so now um let's see find storage how many for a drive da, 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 da. this drive fires one let's craft up one all right we should see it there boom yeah look at that that's cool okay so now we can make one more just oh now we can wait Blah. Now we can make one more disk drive. I like how cheap that was. And boom, put that guy right here. Generate, are using 37 FE per tick. That's really good. I swear we can take that second crafter here, finally, put it like that. Booyah, now we're taking up 41. These use seven, 10. Oh, it depends on how many recipes are in there. Okay. 
crafting monitor seven. Oh, that's combined seven. Whoops. Well, now they're rocking and rolling. We have doubled the, the storage capacity. Isn't that neat? Okay. So now we're on power. Generating about a thousand FE per tick is the estimate. Okay. So I'd like to add in a witch spawn egg. And you can actually make these with the witch hats dropped by witches. Oh, what is this used for? Gilded. What does that actually do? Hmm. I don't know. But I want to try to get one of these. Oh. Capturing a chant. Hmm. Okay. So we don't have um, the ability to really do that yet. But what I want to go ahead and do. Definitely gonna add the wither skeletons. Um, we need to also wash some of this. Gotta sp oh, sorry, I gotta spookify it. Turn off my magnet. Spookify. Oh, we also discovered that the water mills from Create were causing an, a, a massive amount of lag when it came to pairing it with uh, complementary shaders. So if you guys are experiencing of like a lot of frame rate drop. Uh, and you got a lot of the water mills going, just know that it could be the water mills causing all the frame rate. Like I was getting, like I, you guys might have seen a couple of uh, videos, I was getting like 60 frames per second looking at them. Uh, and like I should be up about 140, 150, um, no problem. So it was uh, definitely kind of crazy. So if you guys are experiencing something similar, I recommend doing that. But let's go ahead, get this wither one in. We're gonna put some chorus on there um okay i got a fur log so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna sacrifice one log come down here i'm gonna break this we're good this is still getting items but it's pumping them into our system where it needs to go now we can come up here and all of these guys shouldn't have an ai the blazes might they're just weird nope i don't think they do good We'll do that. No AI. More spawning range. Break this. Grab that. Okay. Close that guy off and we're rocking. I'm gonna do that. So Yep, I already picked up some items. Okay, so we should start getting some blaze material or wither materials in here. Good. Coal. Wither bone. Okay, we're gonna need to add in a chest. So let's take that, let's do this, let's do... Okay, so I did have to expand this a little bit over to here. Uh, added some ender pearl fragments, which are about to actually back up the system. Uh, so I need to go ahead, add this back, but we should be good to go after this. I don't think we'll see anything that we desperately need to get, and then the overflow will be good. I may upgrade that to a, um, whatchamacallit, uh, diamond one, but now we got those. Uh, and then I also want to go ahead and put on the beheading. So let's take a look at what we need for that. Beheading. Here we go. All right. How much gold do I have? We've got a fair a bit of it. We need a hammer. Um, huh. I thought I put in an ore hammer in here. Okay. No worries. We'll just go ahead do this. Do that. Okay, I'll let that cook up. All right, so I just made 10. We need to make a total of 20. So 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Good, we have enough gold for that. All right, we might not even have enough redstone for that, but that's okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Good. All right, and then we wanna make some gold nuggets that's way more than we need but that's okay 10 perfect uh blood moon can i sleep during it i was able to sleep during one ah, i can't do it again oh well i did manage it once it's crazy all right so beheading good should start to see these roll in yep there we go beheading perfect probably means we're also getting other mobs heads creeper head that's totally fine. We are getting the other ones other than the blaze, uh, but that's totally good. No need to worry about that at all. 
Um, we just want the, the wither skeleton ones because we are going to uh, fight a wither now. So one, two, three, we have enough. Let's go ahead and get this rolling. All right, let's see. So I've got a decent bow on me. Um, got a bunch of arrows. Should we fight him during the blood moon? I don't think we should fight him during the blood moon. I think we should hold off on that. Um, let's put some enchants on this guy. Do we have any wax? I don't think we do. Candles? Nope, that's okay. Yeah, let's throw, throw some enchants on the netherite sword. Got capturing. Hmm. Just sweeping edge. Sharpness four and nature's mend. We could do that. That will suffice. All right, time to go AFK for a little bit and let this night pass. We got a trader in here. Oh, we're gonna take the turtle. Turtle, turtle. Got eight advanced turtles. I take the flowers. They'll look nice here. Very good. All right, all, bleh, all right, let's rock and roll. Oh, I need soul sand. Oh my goodness, I have four soul sand left. It's the perfect amount. All right, I think we can fight him here in this cave. Um, yeah, this cave has had held horrors before. It can hold them again. And there we go. So I'm going to eat a notch apple. We'll leave that. All right. You ain't got nothing. I'm nimble. I'm nimbly and bimbly jumping tree branch to tree branch. Dude, just shot my arrow. It's a terrible shot right now. Oh boy. I got hit because I got stuck. This is going crazy. We got him. We got him. We got him on the ropes. We're pushing the wither back into there. We're doing it. I have I have knockback on my hand. Every time we hit him, we got that. There it is, our first nether star. That's amazing. We've earned one perk. What is this? Oh. Oh. Oh, wow. Configuration. We'll do it later. We did it, everyone. Congratulations. Pat yourself on the back. What are we going to use our first nether star on? Hmm. A tool would be a good idea. Maybe a creeper pearl. Maybe that. Maybe a wither builder. Hmm. Hmm. Six to seven. Dank storage. Ooh. Maybe we can make a dank some dank storage right now. Spectral eye amulet. What does that even do? We can make this, but we need the wild and tribute. That's what I was thinking about making is the infinity wand to help us build. Um, Cause everything else we need more. We need more witherless rose. Another star enchanting the rose holder protection against withering. That's pretty cool. Make a beacon, the standard Minecraft thing, a beacon. I think we're gonna make the um, the wand because everything else we need more nether stars. We can make another star generator. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, silk quarry. That does require one. Warding charm. Hmm. Okay. I think we're gonna make the infinity wand. Booyah! That's a great tool. Now we can build lots of things. That's gonna stay on us probably all the time. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please make sure to hit the like button. And as always, guys, don't forget to subscribe. But this has been Super Turtle, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Take care. Peace out. Bye-bye.